Hey guys, I got my first uh, prototypes for my uh, cantilever suspension on my uh, D90. Basically, this is what they look like. With the mounting piece for the frame. Uh, I still have to do a little bit of work on it, but uh, I'm going to try and install them like right now and see how. Uh, how they work. The one thing extra that you're going to need with these is uh, the Intigi uh, spring set for the E-Revo Slash. Uh, basically the springs are a lot harder than the springs that come on the original shocks. And these are nice because they really fit perfectly on. So throw these on here. I'm taking the blue ones because they're the hardest. and. The reason you want harder springs is because with a cantilever system, uh, you're using an advantage. Uh, you're losing the advantage because you're getting a lot more movement out of the same shock, so you're going to need more power. You see how hard that is now? Hopefully that's not too hard, but the Intigi shock uh, spring set comes with various, various uh, spring rates. You got the blue ones with the hardest, and you got the black and the red. So, I'm going to try the blue ones, see how that goes. Basically what I'm trying to do, is I'm trying to use everything stock, screw holes in that, uh, the original shocks, aside from the springs. Uh, so it's basically an add-on, and you use the original springs, that the original, you use the original shocks, uh, but you double your displacement because of the cantilever system. Right off the bat, the uh, finish and fitment is better than my handmade pieces. Okay, one of the main differences that I had from before is this piece here only had one mounting hole, whereas on the new one I got three. If you remove these components inside here, this can be installed on the inside. So basically, this side would be installed in here, and this one on the other side. But uh, the main thing with that is that if you do do that, obviously you won't see anything. It'll be nice and clean on this side. The problem with this one is when you do go all the way, it does touch a little bit. But maximum flex like this doesn't happen that often, and it's not really that bad, so 